In case you didn't know, Chess.com has a lot of different bots that you can play and practice against. And there's a group of those bots that are called the Celebrities, named after streamers. Hikaru's there, Danny Wrench is there, Alexandra Botez is there, and this past week, they made the Gotham bot. So I played two games against the AI version of myself. That's what this video is all about. At the end, I learned an important life lesson, and I want you guys to tell me in the comments what lines should they program into my bot for better trash talk. Enjoy. Um, oh, he gets 50. Okay. All right. Chat, what color do we want? Should, should I play myself with a challenge? Yeah, let's do, let's do um, straight up. Um, all right. Have some time between streams. Want to play? I would never say anything even remotely that polite. D4. D4 is good, not as good as E4, but still good. I like that. I like that. That's a fine move. Did he just compliment his own move? Did I just say that about my... That's a fine move? I've literally never said that. Okay. Queen's Gambit. I also don't play this opening, but that's fine. Knight c3. Ooh, Semislav. That I actually do play. Let's play g3. Um, knight d7. I'm gonna play this queen d3 line. It defends the c4 pawn. Let's go bishop g2. Okay, now... Okay, let's really get started. Bro, you took a pawn, bro. Who are you trash-talking? Stupid. Okay, so the thing about this is that you've given away the c-pawn for the d-pawn. And uh, what you can do now is plant the queen and push two pawns into the center. Now black really should... Yeah, that stops me from going e4 because he'll go here. Um, now let's play bishop g5. If h6, I'll probably take... Uh, take... Yo, did my bot really just play g takes f6? Y'all really made this man 2,500? GF6 is the dumbest move ever. Are you guys serious? Oh, he plays like me, huh? Yeah, makes sense. Okay, so now rather than taking, we, like I said, we want to take the center. We want to the, make them take. Now, both BC3 and Queen C3 are actually reasonable. Because I guess you can play Queen here and here. I'm assuming the bot will also play E5 at some point. Queen c3 stops e5. Let's just go here for now. That stops e5. Okay, now my bot is just straight up giving away a pawn. But maybe that's the only way to, like, not lose, honestly. Because otherwise black doesn't have any moves. e5 is also very strong. It's tough. Um, this gives my... Give, this gives the guy counterplay. I'm actually not gonna take. I'm gonna play in more controlled fashion. Maybe just going for this. I also really like this e5 move. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so bot doesn't take. Uh, now queen e3 can go for the pawn, like I said. And at a certain moment, I have to probably route my knight. Um, how are we going to do this? Knight h4, knight d2. Ooh, this is tough. I can also take and put my knight on e5. Oh, it all looks good. All of it looks good. I don't know. How about rook c1 and rook d1? That's what we'll do. Oh, but f5 is a smart move. I forgot about f5. The robot played a good move. It's kind of rare. I wasn't expecting that from myself. How about h3 and g4, though? Just trying to break at the structure here. Yeah, my rook is under attack, so now I just centralize it. Nothing, um... Complimenting myself? Okay, bishop b5 is a completely idiotic move, so it looks like I've taken over again. Bishop b5 literally does nothing. I mean, it guards the pawn, but I had no aspirations to take it anyway, so... Rook h8 is logical, because the king, at some point, will be anticipating... Um, b3 to go a4. That looks pretty smart. What will the bot play? Oh, bishop a3. Rook c2. So my, um... Yeah, that stops me. Weird game, man. This is a very strange position. Knight d2, c5... Something with d5. Knight e4, take. Maybe like a queen f4 here. I need to figure out how I'm going to make forward progress. I also can go here, here, and rook h1. That's kind of a cool plan. I don't actually know what I'm playing for. I appreciate the subs and the primes, guys. I don't 
exactly see you right now. Um, okay, now knight d2 looks really good. But then maybe there's queen g5. Let's go knight d2. There's no way my bot will beat me in an endgame, because that just... That just doesn't make any sense. My, my bot would not... Okay, my bot's just attacking rooks. I'm not actually a good endgame player, so there's no way I lose in the endgame. Or win in the endgame, I should say. What is... Stop harassing my rooks. What is wrong with you? Can't they just take? Okay, I'm just gonna take. Maybe that was bad. Maybe the bot is a genius. Oh, wait, it's a bot. Aha. Uh, -huh. uh rook c1? Just get out of this pin? Rook e3 just takes the knight. So if rook e3, bishop takes knight. So this gets out of the pin, but actually that sets up another pin, which I don't like. Hmm. Bishop e4, take. Rook takes. It looks really stupid. But frankly, might be my only way to untangle here. Oh my god, what is that? Take? Jeez. What a move. Huh? I'm gonna draw my bot. Take, take, here, 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 here. It's crazy. My bot and I are gonna... I don't lose a piece, chat. There's too many things hanging. Um... Is that the only thing that I have? I can go queen f6. And what that does is it loses a pawn. But at least I don't open the position. I guess I'll just take. You're just going to attack... What did he say? You aren't attached to your queen? Okay, then. Yeah, whoever, co whoever coded what I say was like doing their worst impression of a New Yorker ever. But I respect the attempt. I would say that for sure. I mean, I would say some expletives, probably. I wouldn't be so reserved. So now the bishop goes to f4, and yeah, I don't think I can win this. I don't think I can lose it, but I also don't think I can win it. Uh, yeah, that bishop is way too strong. Do bots take draws? Can I, can I offer my bot a draw? I think bishop a6 is important because I feel like I have to stop this. I can also just move my king up here. Check here, check. Draw? No draw. Okay, bot wants to beat me down material. Fair. I mean, it's a robot. It's cheating, so... Um, take, rookie one. So d5 is strong, take, take. Oh, d5 is very strong. Oh, d5 is very strong. Oh, I did say I wasn't good at uh, at end games, right? Let's go uh, rook d5. Now we're threatening a discovered attack. What? Oh my god. That's it, man. We're gonna draw. My bot is gonna. We're. Which, I think I need to go for um a7. But going for e5 also actually looks reasonable. Oh man. That's just a draw. I can go rook d8 and trade here. Um, rook a5 wins this pawn. Do I play for a win versus my bot? I think I do, right? Check, king up. I play for a win. I play for a win. Of course I play for a win. You're just going to attack my king no dinner first? You're just going to attack my king no dinner first. Okay, I, um, okay, got him. I'm up, I'm up two pawns against my bot, by the way. How did this happen? I'm safe. Check clam. Bro, I've never said that. Who says check clam? I feel like y'all straight up took a Ben Feingold line and put it as what I would say. God, man, come on. Anyway, uh, let's go uh, a4 maybe? Okay. Whoa. Am I bot trying to mate me here? Yo, yo, stop repeating the same line. Check. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. There's no mate. 
I'm still safe. There's no mate. But it definitely doesn't look nice. The problem is that this late in the game, the engine is always going to be super accurate. Which is really frustrating. It's really difficult to deal with. Um, okay, I feel like that's the best move. Oh, is he gonna take? Actually, if takes, then... Okay, if takes, then I think I'm happy. Wow, what a wild endgame. So, bishop g2? What is happening? Somehow, man. I mean, rook e4 doesn't do anything because the rook just moves. Okay. Okay, king e1, bishop f2, king f1, bishop c5, king e1. What a wild position. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The last time that I played a bot on stream, I kind of lost my mind. And I did some really bad things. So this time... Let's try to keep our nerves. And try to not blunder anything. If they're... I want to go rook c3. So king f1, rook f6. Oh, I also have king e2. Okay, let's go here. Yeah, you just said check slam, my guy. You don't need to say it again. Thanks. So king e2, rook f2. I calculated this far and I thought I was okay. Am I not? Is this losing? Oh my god, am I gonna draw my bot? Tough position. Oh! Okay, bot doesn't want to draw. Okay, uh, in that case I should probably get out. Well, bots never accept draws. Fun fact. If you guys want a way to beat a robot, it never accepts a draw. Go rook c6. Should I go rook c6? Does that force a trade? No, there's bishop a5. Rook c6, bishop a5. If this, this. That's bad. b4? Or move my, move, move my guy. b4, bishop f2. But okay, the bot will not repeat, right? Oh, but the bot will win my pawn. Oh, the bot is going to win my pawn. Oh my gosh, bishop c5. I completely forgot about this, like, the second I played it. Oh, that's a brutal move. Okay. Yikes. Oh, it's still a draw. Okay. Yay, I still drew! Yay! I still drew my bot. Now, it's still a draw, but at least all my winning chances are gone now. Wait, is the bot not gonna... What? What is going on? So this is an opposite-colored bishop endgame. It's gonna take my pawn, of course. Wow. Bro, move your pawn. What are you doing? Okay. I'm so stubborn. Alright. Oh my gosh, bot, come on, dude. That's it, enough. Enough. Stubborn bot. Oh, are you a sore loser because your bot is acting like it? I'm happy with the draw from that position. Would you like to play again? Wow. Who would have thought, huh? King versus king. Amazing. That was, um... That was an intense game. I gotta tell you, wow. That was awesome. Okay. I gotta, I gotta play my bot again. I mean, if you're really trying to farm, you know who you gotta play, so... Uh, Alright, let's play the bot. Uh, I'm gonna play black. Um, yeah, I can... I can... 
I'll send them what to say against me, so... Um... Alright, I have some time between- Bro, you like this opening? Bro, what is this?! Um, uh, no, no, we're not even playing. No. What? What? No! No. No. New game. I- no. Oh, resignation. Yeah, resignation. Oh, oh, yeah, of course. No. What is E3? No bot of mine is gonna play E3. Y'all for real? Y'all serious right now? Yeah, y'all. Yeah. I'm gonna try this one more time. I'm gonna give y'all the count of three. I'm gonna give you the count to three. Alright? To program me to play a different opening. One. Two. Three. Okay, I see how it is. Evidently, I have to punish the bot. I will play the dodge defense. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. Now we're in a dutch. Let's castle. Um, let's play d6. I think I played this against Beth Harmon, too. And I'm gonna play Queen E8. So the point of Queen E8 is to go E5. This is a, a mainline idea against the Dutch. It's, it's kind of crazy how much worse white already is in this position. Now E4 hits the knight. If my bot... Oh my gosh, what is my bot doing? Very important here. Lock the center. Um, yeah, so this is, this is thematic. The bot wants to go here. H6, knight H3, and G5. This is like the, the peak Dutch attack. And I think on the next move, we go, um, we can play f4, take, and then, like, queen e6, maybe? Or c6, f4, all these different ideas, or just delay it by a move. Yeah, queen g6 is nice, because then I, we have a really nice idea. Okay, so normally if you take, they, they actually can't take with the bishop because of g4. But then there would be knight f4 counterattacking, so I think what I'll do... Um, is I will play, I will play f4 myself. No, but f4 takes. f4 takes, I don't like that. Maybe hold it all together here. Just stay patient again, just stay patient, don't do anything crazy. Okay, let's really get started. You're like, dead lost here, guy. Who, like, oh wait, no, that's kind of normal, actually. That's kind of normal. I do trash talk when I am dead lost. That makes a lot of sense. I, I don't really have a filter of when I trash talk and when I don't. Okay, knight f2 is, is logical. Um, knight f2 is logical, obviously, because maybe knight, knight here. Now, c6 shuts down the whole thing on the queen side. Um... I guess, I, I mean, h5 just looks too natural not to play. Just don't let him get anything. He's still trying to break through. Now c6 kind of plays into white's hands. White can also play c6. Uh, I think g4 is good. g4 looks very natural also. So, okay. What's happening? Now that takes away the b6 square. I guess I can play rook b8 anticipating the opening of the file. I can also play rook f7 so my knight can come around. Ooh, that's actually kind of a cool plan. Might be a little slow. But I really like it. h4. I can also double my rooks. No, something... Something very bad is about to happen to my bot. It's, uh, it's like from iRobot. Not to spoil what's actually happening uh, in the movie. But this is not, this is about to be an iRobot moment. Uh, we here come the two rooks. This is um this is getting very bad. Yeah, my bot is wearing the galaxy hoodie that I have. Should I wear it? Damn, I should have worn the hoodie to play my bot. That would have been really funny. Uh, g3. Bishop h6. What are we doing here? 
I mean, this looks stunningly natural to inc improve the position of the dark squared bishop. Okay, now a life lesson is that if you ever want to attack on a certain side of a board, you need to lock that position. But b6, I'm trying to think, like, is there some crazy sacrifice the bot can play here? I'm thinking the bot can take on f6 and then take on d5. Oh my gosh, the bot is now playing against my knight here. Okay. Do I just go all in? And then take? The bot will play h3. I can take it. And then I can take g2. Or do I play knight b8? I'm worried about rook f6. Why am I worried about rook f6 exactly? Why exactly was I worried about rook See, this is the thing. Now my knight is out of the game. Uh... Let's go bishop g5, I guess? And also cage. Cage the opponent even more. It seems a lot more natural not to do that. Ooh, tough position. What, what do I play? Bishop g5 here, bishop h4, something goes to g3. I can take it, and then I can play knight h5. My knight out of the game is actually way more of a problem than I thought it was. Let's go queen h5. Uh-oh. Hmm. I was very motivated to win this game. I'm not gonna lie. And now I can feel it sl starting to slip away. How do you guard this? Okay, once... Oh my gosh, I mean, this just looks so bad. This just looks so terrible. Like all of my positions. But how do I win? We've gotten this far. How do I actually win here? If I trade the rooks, am I even winning? This is crazy. I'm just, I mean, this, this, I, this whole idea here to lock my knight away. Man, like, I want to, you know, I'm looking at this now, but there's still nothing, like, I, I guess I, I'm going to go have to go with rook h7. I don't know. Because this doesn't even work, because that's guarded. Now let's go here. So what if take... How about knight h5? Trading? No, 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 no. I'm not going to go knight h5. Let's go knight e8. No, but I can't go knight e8 because g4 is hanging. Eh. <laughs> That's the noise of confusion. Take knight g3. Take knight g3, bishop h4. Take. Or queen h3. That looks so good. That looks so good. Rook g2. Let's go here. Huh? Huh? Has it lost its mind? It's lost its mind. I think that's the engine admitting that it's finally blundered. I think it's finally blundered. Rook f6. Oh. Oh, now I'm, now I'm, now I'm extra nervous. Now I am extra nervous. Oh my gosh, the rook, the rook is just, is just gone. If the second rook falls, knight f5. The engine's gone off the deep end. Rook f5. <gasps> oh god. Take, take, uh, 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 queen, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Bam, 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 take. And then queen e6. And, and, and it can't go queen d8 because, because I'm blocking. Queen e6. The bishop is... Take queen e6. And this is... Th 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 that's it. The queen's traded. The queen's traded by force. The queen's traded by force. It's just the home trash. I don't need my queen anymore. Oh my god, we're gonna win. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on a second. All right, our knight is still total buns over here on this side of the board. So we just play rook f7. 
It's easy, easy, easy. Rook f7. Rook f7. Let's uh, go trade u2. I think. Do we need to do we need trades here? Wait, what about just bishop b3? Bishop b3 should be good enough because if I get this, I should get that too. And I blundered something immediately. Or did I? Because if I take. I have rook g7 here, by the way. Don't I have rook g7? With the pin. Ah. Of course. Rook h7, though? Wait, rook h7? Isn't rook h7? Oh, but bishop, bishop here? I hate computers. Oh my god, they're so resilient. I want to take, but that doesn't work. Take, 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 take. At this point, you basically just need to simplify. Bishop d1, take. I'll just bring you back. Okay, that bishop is off the board. Oh, just rook g7. That's it. Just rook g7. Oh, not just rook g7. What am I talking about? Why didn't I just take the knight? Uh... That was a little stupid. I will have to sacrifice my knight at some point. That's what I'm going to have to do. My knight is just totally out of the game here. Um, I guess I can take now. And bishop takes. It's still, like, annoying to play this position. Because of the constant, like, threat of this coming in. Rook g2? Go rook g2. Wow. A trade. What? Seriously? What on earth is happening? Oh, I can't play rook h7. Because of a fork. Uh... How do these bots do this? They're, like, they're so resourceful, it's scary. I mean, yeah, I have rook c2, and then I can just... Sacrifice here, but insane. King e7, knight d5, king d6. This is crazy. I think I'm. Sh Am I straight up losing here? Wow. Wow. I don't know what to say. I don't know. That is unbelievable. So king f8, knight c7, king e7 here. That is surreal, man. The c7 move? What on earth? <sighs> My mind is blown completely. Yeah. Um, rook c2, knight c7, knight c6, b c6, rook c6, knight b5 is the problem. That at the end there's knight b5 and my a7 pawn is falling. If check, I'm straight up just lost here, I think. That is crazy. Okay. Wow. My mind is blown. That is so crazy. <laughs> I don't need my queen anymore even after promoting. Okay, now my bot is starting to make mistakes. Are you kidding me? Now it makes mistakes? 
it just played like one of the most brilliant sacrificial ideas of human of like recorded history and now it starts blundering here 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 rookie four knight f6 b5 e8 take take b4 knight f6 b3 oh wow 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 this is pain. This is Spain without the S. I don't know what to do. I mean, rookie two, e6, king. This is unbel. This is unreal. What it's doing. It's gonna beat me by one pawn. I don't even think it had to play that move, but it did. I am sad. Ah, my final pawn. Go. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. Then he would take it. Wait a minute. Is this a draw? Just don't hang your your pawn. Yo, what is this endgame? What is this endgame? Oh my gosh. How fitting that the bot ends by blundering a draw. I am speechless. What an insane endgame. It's not taking the pawn. It... It's not taking the pawn. It's refusing to take my pawn. There we go. Wow. Wow. It played so bad, that game, and I couldn't do it. I couldn't finish the job. Wowie. 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 It played 96.5. Yeah, okay. Okay. <sighs> that's, that's brutal. Okay. So, I was only ever slightly better. This position is equal? What do you mean this position is equal? No, no. One of these positions is, has to be winning. Yeah. Knight h1. And what did I miss? What did I not do? Okay, apparently I didn't play the best plan. This is still very good. Okay, queen h5 was a mistake. How could I have won here? I still think it blundered. That's crazy. White has the advantage here. Okay, it blundered here. Oh, of course. And now, what did I miss? I missed... Bishop g3, not taking back the rook, but bishop to g3? Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I got so excited. I got so excited. And then I just... I threw away the advantage. It's crazy. It played against this knight. Now then it was winning. It was winning for sure. So what did it miss? 
My 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 bot also couldn't couldn't win a position where it had forced checkmate. And is this just the draw? No, nope, it could have played knight b4. Of course, of course. So my it turns out that my bot is terrible both ways. I'm terrible and my bot is terrible. I'm terrible. Wonderful. What a great life lesson I got playing against the simulated version of myself. After knight b4, king c7, king e7, I'm in a box. The king is gonna go win my pawn. And uh, in this position, after king c5, king a4, and something like knight c6, I just lose. Fantastic! Thanks, Just.com. What an important life lesson that we learned.